I'm Steph, lead trainer and founder of Online Yoga School. Thank you for joining me today. We're going to go over Upward Salute, Urdhva Hastasana. So let's hop on the mat and get to it. Now, we're going to take all the principles from Mountain Pose and apply those here. So I won't repeat everything that we learned in the Mountain Pose video. If you didn't see it, go take a look. Um, the feet can come either big toes together, heels a little apart, or if that's causing you some compression in your knees or your thighs, step the feet about hips width apart. And from here, begin to rock back and forth, lift the toes, and make sure that you feel grounded. Spread the toes wide, and then ground the toes back down. Lift up through the quadriceps, sit bones are stacking right over the ankles, and we're gonna engage the belly, which is gonna draw the tailbone down just a little bit. Nip the ribs here. Now from here, roll the shoulders up and back, and we're gonna get ready to go into upward salute. So let's raise the hands about shoulders width apart and see what happens. So for some of us, nothing happens. Some of us can keep lifting the arms, we can take them all the way back, maybe even beyond the ears. There might be some hypermobility going on. But I always say where there's strength, there's not as much flexibility, and when there's flexibility, there's probably not as much strength. So for someone that has a lot of, of shoulder strength, kind of muscular here, or even someone that's had a shoulder injury, what can happen as the arms raise, the higher the arms get, everything gets tight through here and the chest starts to collapse, the head comes forward, the chin draws down towards the chest. And so we want to avoid that. So if you find that you or one of your students starts to collapse as they raise the shoulders up like this, then maybe they only come right here. There's nothing magical about going further. The idea is that you want to honor your body where it is, whatever that means for you. So what we'll do, come into mountain pose, and then begin to raise the arms right about to shoulders height. Notice what happens with the chest. If it's still feeling open, you can take the arms all the way up. Now from this space, you may bring the palms together. You may keep the hands apart and kind of internally rotate the palms, spin the pinky fingers in if that feels good, and go back as far as you can. And once you get here, you're gonna take a few breaths. And what we're doing is we're leaving space for the prana, the energy to flow upwards, what we call Udana Vayu in yoga. So let the breath, let the energy move upwards through the body and notice what's happening with the shoulders. If they're squinching up towards the ears, Take a moment and roll them back and down. Kind of plug them back into the shoulder socket. Pull them back in. And this, my friends, is Ordva Hastasana Upward Salute.